Alright, hey guys, I'm going to make this video as fast and as quick as I can. This is going to be a June favorites video. I haven't done one of these in a very long time, so hopefully this stuff will be new to you guys. So let's get started. First, I'm going to start out with two bags that I have been using pretty much all month. And the first one is this, if you guys can see me, this hot pink bag that I got from Just Fab. And this is what it looks like in the inside. And I use this bag a lot when I go to my boyfriend's house and to um, travel with my film equipment over to his house so we can do different videos. So that's what that bag is for. And this is my other favorite. And this is technically, I guess you could say it could also be like a yearly favorite in a way. I've had this bag since I turned 21. My mom got it for me. It's a Dooney and Burke bag and these hold up so beautifully and I already know that I'm going to have it for a very very long time so thank you mom if you ever see this. Next I am going to show you guys the eyeshadow palette that I have been using quite a lot this month and it's the Mirage palette 88 eyeshadow colors from Coastal Scents so this is what it looks like and then this is what it looks like when you open it I can't even see okay there we go <laughs> so this is what it looks like and a lot of the colors really work for me because I like to use a lot of neutral colors and maybe like a little bit of gold so that's what works well for me okay so the next items are going to be hair related this is a hair wrap that I don't think I've ever worn this in a video but this is a hair wrap that I ended up getting from Claire's it, um, they had a sale I have another one but I haven't been using that one at all so this is why I'm showing this one I wear this to work quite a lot it's very very nice and I actually wore this in one of my photo shoots so I'm gonna give you all a quick close up of that again and there you go next I have two hair gels that I have been using quite a lot when I do like my twist outs on my hair and you guys have probably seen this before if you've been watching my videos for a while the Shea Moisture Coconut and Hibiscus Curling Gel Souffle and I've had this for such a long time, guys. This is almost an empty, like really. You can actually kind of see that I have a little bit left in there. So there's that one. And the other one I use is the Echo Styler Gel. I use the olive oil kind. So I still have quite a lot of that left. And these actually define my curls very, very well. So that's why those are my top favorite gels and I plan on repurchasing them when the time comes. Next, I've only been using these products for a very short time this month but they are definitely my top favorites in a way for hair stuff. They're in the top favorites. There we go. That's a good one. The Shea Moisture, here we go again, Jamaican Black Castor Oil Strengthen Grow and Restore Leave-In Conditioner with Shea Butter, Peppermint and Keratin. That is a mouthful, and that's what it is. And I have been using this since I pretty much purchased it. This is going to be really difficult. That's the best I can do because it's kind of runny, and I don't want it to fall all over the floor. And I also have same long name that I just said with shea butter and apple cider vinegar. It's the shampoo. So... Yep. Hopefully that focused enough. If it didn't, I'm sorry. My bad. But you can always look it up on their website. So, yep. I've been using both of these and they work really well together and in my hair and I'm absolutely loving the results. Next on the list, just a few more hair things, guys. Just bear with me. The Carol's Daughter Minoy Repairing Shampoo and Conditioner and the Hair Mask, which is in a like little round bottle, but I have the travel sizes of those because this was kind of like a trial period. Let me do that a little bit better. Okay, and then there's that. So this was just more like a trial period to see if I like them and if I wanted to purchase the 
bigger sizes and I do like them. I do. I like them a lot. But um, Shea Moisture is kind of my go-to brand. So once I finish up a, more of my Shea Moisture stuff, I might go back to Carol's Daughter and get those. But we'll see down the road. But I do have another Carol's Daughter product that I do plan on repurchasing. And it's the Carol's Daughter Black Vanilla Leave-In Conditioner. It's in the purple packaging. And if I can show you guys, that's how much I have left. And I use this in my hair daily. When I wake up, I pick my hair out and I spray this in. And I also have um, a little spray bottle with water in it and I spray that too and I kind of shape my hair and form it the way I want to for the day. And this stuff really helps. And it also smells good too, which is a plus. All right, now moving on to smell goods, things that make you smell absolutely fabulous. Sorry about that, I'm running out of space on my camera, so I just deleted some stuff real quick, and I'm going to finish this as fast as I can. All right, so speaking of things that make you smell good, there we go. This is the deodorant that I have been using quite a lot this month. It's by Nature's Gate Herbal Blend Deodorant, Tea Tree, and Blue Cypress. This stuff smells really, really good, and I like it. I wouldn't be showing it to y'all if I didn't like it. Now, next. Japanese Cherry Blossom Bath & Body Works Shower Gel and Lotion. Now, as you guys can see, I haven't used that much of either, but it takes only a little bit because this is a very strong scent. To me, it's, it's quite strong, but it does stay with you the entire day, which is why I really like it. Another lotion is the Obey Your Body Optimal Indulgence Shea Nut Body Butter in Kiwi. And I've been using this, like I said, this month. It smells really good. And a lot of it's like pushed off to the side. So I have plenty of product left to last me for maybe another month or two, maybe three if I really push it. And um, let me do this one first. Sorry about that. This, totally random, but yes, honey, olive oil. Natural hair girls, y'all know what I'm trying to say, okay? These oils really do help you retain that moisture, and they also work very well on your scalp to promote growth, especially if you give yourself a little scalp massage. And I always try to get my boyfriend to give me my scalp massages because he's really good at it. So, that's always like something really, really nice that I like. Totally random, just felt like sharing that. And also, last favorite, I've had this for a very, 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 very long time. Like three going on four, heck, it's probably even five years. But this is the Britney Spears Fantasy Perfume. Just, it smells awesome. And every time I wear this, people tell me I smell awesome. So this is why I like it. 